Hello everyone and welcome to my playthrough of Fatal Frame 2 as a continuation of the Halloween Horror Months that I am holding on my stream. This video will be uploaded to my Stream Dumps channel, so go check it out, even though it's just a Stream Dump. Literal Let's Play. Anyway, I think we can just go straight to this. Yep. Okay, cool. Didn't we always promise each other that we would always be together? to play here all the time. Yeah. All of this will be gone soon. Is your leg okay? Does it hurt? It does a little, but I'm fine. Mia? Yes? <laughs> Never mind. that time back then. Mayu? Mayu! Where are you going? So, we are Mio, and Mayu is missing, I guess. Oh yeah, I learned my lesson from last time. The controls are a little tankier this time, I think. The path disappears just after the statue that looks like guardian deities. Game seems quiet. Well, it is pretty quiet. I don't know if I need to like turn this up anymore, but I mean, so far it's just ambient noise. Yeah, I'll turn it up a little bit. Why not? If it gets too loud or, like, overpowering, I'll just turn it down later. Uh, Shoutouts to Random Slashes for the Prime and Odd Bolt for the Tier 1. Everyone please raise them cars to hypes in chat. And welcoming our new fine feline friends to the Poos Patrol. Thank you so much.
Uh, no, it, I'm I'm just turning down the aspect ratio because I think there might actually be some extra post processing coming from the PS3 that's causing uh, input delay. But that's just a theory I have. I've heard about this place. A long time ago, there was a village here that disappeared during a festival. People who get lost in the woods are trapped by the village. Could this be that place? Chapter 1. The Lost Village. I heard singing before, but there's nobody here. So without spoiling the game, can anyone tell me how many chapters there are? Tell them like stone pillars are lined up around the pedestal. Maybe it's some kind of altar. Ten chapters? Oh man. Is this game like a lot longer than Fatal Frame 1? There is something on the ground. A black bag. There are several pieces of paper and a photo inside. News clipping. A news clipping from a year ago. The headline reads, Geological Surveyor Missing. With the start of construction for all God's Dam approaching, Masumi Makimura a geological surveyor dispatched to the area has gone missing. Mr. Makimura went to the area to investigate the site that would be submerged once the dam was built, but hasn't been heard from for five days. Follow up to that other news clipping. The search for Masumi Makimura, 26, the surveyor missing since the 4th of the month, came to a close yesterday. Mr. Makimura had been helping to conduct a geological survey for All God's Dam, as of yesterday, he has been missing for 10 days. Couple. A photo of a man and a woman are attached to the news clipping. You put the news clipping and the photo of the couple in your file. Notes, photos, and maps can be browsed by choosing file from the menu. Whose is this, I wonder? Who else is here? Yeah, there's someone over there. Guess we go in this way. I wonder if anyone's here. Mm. Are you <gasps> Mia? Yeah. Stream time, brother. Thank you so much, Master Medi, for the five months. You can see a kimono room beyond the lattice. You could probably get to it from somewhere inside the house. There are some boxes on the shelf. You can't reach them. There's a big tub here. A shelf has fallen on its lid. You can't look inside. Get out of the way, Mayu.
Mayu? Mayu! What's wrong? I don't want to kill anyone. <laughs> <laughs> Did Masumi kill that woman? What was that? I don't know. I don't know. So we got a photo of a man and a woman. We don't know their relation. But it could be inferred that the man is Masumi and... Mio, don't go too far. He killed someone? By the way, somebody asked earlier if I'd played this game before. No, I have not. I played, like, the first chapter a couple of times. Like, just to just to kind of piddle around with it. But I didn't really, like... I didn't really, like, actually try to concentrate on a playthrough. Thank you, Ryder, for the two months of your continued support. So that being said, uh, please don't backseat me. Unless I ask for help. I'm actually trying to give it the good old college try. But uh, if I'm like lost after 30 minutes, then I'll ask for help. Because I don't want to like ruin the pace of the stream. Woman's Notebook 1. I've heard rumors about the lost village before. Long ago, a massacre occurred on the day of the ceremony, and the village was wiped from the map. Twin deity statues in the forest lead lost people to the village entrance. Once you pass through the gate, however, you cannot go back. The village eternally relives that night of death. The insane laughter of a woman is said to echo throughout the village. The only survivor of the massacre at the village was a lone woman. Okay. Thank you, woman. Thank you for your notebook. That's a uh, kimono. Woman's notebook two. A page torn from a notebook is on top of a cabinet. Sometimes I sense someone passing by the window. He carries a torch and mutters things. He seems to be searching for somebody, but it's not Masumi. In the distance, I can hear some kind of sad ceremonial song being sung. They say that this village vanished on the day of a ceremony, and that day is repeated over and over again. I feel like we're being watched by someone. Oh, sacred water, nice. That's a, that's a good first item to come across. They look like women's kimonos. Please move out of my way. Yeah. 
Yeah, the game doesn't actually tell you if you are, uh... Hey, wait a minute. Did I check out the rest of that room? I'm not sure I did. Because it said there was a, uh, there was a red butterfly over there. Oh. This lantern has a dim glow. The game can be saved here. Oh. Alright, so where do we go next? I'm guessing I'll just work on the first floor and then figure out the second floor. You can see a deck beyond the atrium. A torn notebook page that was stuffed into the bedding has fallen out. Someone, anyone, whoever sees this, look for me. I'm trapped in this village. Help me. Miyako Sudo. Miyako Sudo. I guess that's uh, I guess that's the woman's name. The sliding door of the closet won't open anymore. Maybe it's warped. All right, so this room is this room is looking like a dead end. Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much, Lord Draco84, for the 16 months. Appreciate it. How you doing today? Thank you so much for your continued support. And what is this? We can go forward, left, or right, huh? I kept searching for you. Do we want to follow her yet? I think I'll uh I think I'll check out the rest of the place here before I follow her. Anything here? Okay. Yeah, we got to follow her. So st there's stairs up and there's stairs down. Half tempted to mute Discord, the pings keep coming in and covers the chat box. Well, yeah, I would, uh, Cold. I would say turn off notification badges from, like, the sys tray. And I usually turn off, like, message pings on Discord. It's pretty bad. Woman's Notebook 3, a piece of a memo is on the floor. Masumi, it's me, Miyako. I came to look for you. Let's go home together. Together we can make it. Call for me if you find this. I'll be nearby. Miss you. I wonder if anyone's really here. Is this the deck? Cool damp wind is blowing in from the atrium. There's lanterns. Some work murky water in the wash bin. Can we step down? It looks like we can uh looks like we can go down into that area if we go this way. If Mayu will get the fuck out of our way. Um, I guess not. Okay.
Something's strange about this place. There's a flashlight on the table. Camera Obscura Pointers. An old book is under the flashlight. Camera Obscura Pointers is written on the cover. This camera was made by Dr. Osso to take photographs of beings in the spiritual plane that normally cannot be seen. It can reveal events from the past through its lingering thoughts of individuals. It is also able to photograph spiritual beings that are invisible to the human eye. Taking a photo of an unseen being has an exorcismal effect, but ultimately creates a sort of link with them. If the camera obscura is used carelessly, these beings may even gain the upper hand on the user. I wonder if I can photograph the, for the site at the heart of this village's forbidden ritual. If Dr. Osso were here, I'm sure he would be excited. Seijiro Makabe. Basic camera operation. Raise the camera with the circle button. If you face the direction where your spirit is, the filament at the bottom right will glow. Or the top of the viewfinder will glow when you found a spirit. Okay. Am I missing a... Uh, an item I can pick up. Herbal medicine. Now we got the camera. That's not the door. I don't think I want to go that way. Uh oh.
Uh, the distortion effect is not quite as intense. Oh, there it is. Door woman. It's gone. Come on, let's get out of here. The presence you were feeling in front of the door is gone now. It said you can capture things that ordinary people can't see with this camera. Could this be the power of the camera obscura? There's a padlock engraved with a family crest representing Ginger on the door. Mia. Yeah, we just checked that. Yeah. Really? So, what? Can I check it again? Maybe? Cuz I didn't see uh I didn't see a key to unlock the store anywhere. The million dollar question that I have is, what the hell are these kids doing in the village in the first place? <laughs> Looking for drugs! Really? So there's just like no reason for, their, for them to be here? Oh, more herbal medicine, that's good. I think we're meant to go in there. Brazier, all right. Good, we got our first clue. Let's go check that out. 
Yeah, for this game, you gotta... For the Fatal Frame games, you gotta really concentrate... Sorry about that. I was just uh, reading my messages. By the way, we sort of low-key agreed that the new abbreviation would be PZ for Project Zero instead of FF for Fatal Frame. Because FF for FF for Fatal Frame. It's like Final Fantasy fucking claimed that acronym fucking ages ago. Something shows in the photo. It looks like an injured man. I guess we can go in there now. Is that Masumi? But now there aren't any Fatal Frame games on PS4. Fatal Frame went squarely to Nintendo after Fatal Frame 3. Do we check out here again? Court of the net is saying about is dropping from the weight of the dust and is damp from the moisture. Neo, look. Man, there's an awful lot of just when you think there's nothing to be found in the room, something changes. <laughs> I think that's uh, Miyako. The ghost of Miyako. It's a pancake mix. Uh, Glorious Strategist, if you type in exclamation mark Halloween, you can see what I'm playing this month, or what I... rather, the games that I am planning on having as sub goals for the month. There's a padlock engraved with a family crest representing Ginger on the door. Ginger key.
Yeah, I don't think that... I don't think that it's the death knell of the series, but... It sure is annoying. I haven't even opened this menu yet. Spirit orbs work differently in this game. Woman's Notebook 6. How much time has passed since I came here? How long will this night last? I can't take the darkness. It's driving me crazy. I have to get out of here. I have to see Masumi. Type 61 film. I must be tired. If I start to relax, I pass out. Even in a crazy place like this, the darkness here is creeping into my dreams. Slaughter. Rivers of blood. Fallen people. A woman in a blood-stained kimono. Insane laughter. And twin sisters calling out, Don't kill me. That woman's laugh is seared into my mind. I don't want to sleep anymore. Is this how you become a ghost? Please, please move. Thank you. Masumi found my note. He was in the village. I can see him soon. I can't move. I'll wait here. He'll be back. He'll find the way out. If he comes back. He came. The last part of the memo stops abruptly. She also became trapped here. She came into this house looking for her boyfriend. And then, where did she go? That was a zero shot. <laughs> All right, it seems a lot simpler this time.
Hands off my sister, bitch. Chapter 2, Twin Shrine Maidens. There's something on the floor. Aragonite. Looks like a glowing blue crystal. That spirit must have dropped it. Once you find the spirit stone radio, you can use radio on the menu to listen to stones. Spirit orb acquired. Spirit orbs are items used to raise the maximum levels of the camera's basic functions or power-up lenses. Spirit orb from function upgrades on the camera menu to increase the maximum level of a camera function or power-up power lens. After adding a spirit orb to one of the camera's basic functions or power-up lenses, you can raise its level by using the points you've accumulated through capturing spirits. I see. Huh. Radio. The Spirit Stone Radio. Through the use of crystals in its circuits, this improved version of a crystal radio is able to tune into voices from the spirit world. If a person wears a crystal for a long time, their thoughts will remain within, creating a special type of crystal, a spirit stone. According to Dr. Osso, the radio can also pick up sounds from the spirit world, indicating feelings and intuitions in a similar manner to the sympathetic phenomenon that occurs between twins. So let's see, in the last two minutes we got like seven subs. Uh, Unseen2339, thank you so much for the tier one. Everyone please raise them Carsey Hypes in chat. And welcoming Unseen2339 to the Poos Platoon. And thank you so much High and Holy for gifting five subs to Diadoloth, Sadistic Pillows, The Monkey with a Gun, Aegis Evander, and PhysX. Appreciate it, high and holy. Thank you so much. And thank you, clean up on aisle 7 for the 12 months. One year get. Appreciate it, y'all. Thank you so much. Am I going fucking crazy, or did Twitch slightly change its font? I don't think it really changed its font. It might have, might have changed... Actually, you know what? It kind of did a little bit. I didn't really notice that until now. Looks a lot, uh... Looks a lot curvier. It's nice. Hello, Carcinogen. Your YouTube channel is phenomenal. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you, Chef Ubero, for the 62 months. Acidic hype. Folklorist 1. I'm going to drink some water one sec. By the way, are you guys able to hear the creaking in my chair whenever I move around? I don't really know. Headphone users? Sort of, but it's not like really bad. Oh. Okay. Right. So let's go ahead and read this. The ceremony master, Mr. Kurosawa, gave me a very warm welcome. The village has no chief. The ceremony master presides over the village. I wonder if this village was founded by people who wanted to preserve their sacred rituals and festivals. Most notable among all God's folklore is the gate to hell legend that has been passed down for years. Oh boy, here we go again. It is an archetypical tale of a gate or hole that marks the border to the world of the dead, also called Hades. 
the underworld, or the netherworld. It is a forbidden place that is feared and hated, but it is also worshipped as well. The idea of hell has been a core belief of humans since ancient times. This village supports the theory that the belief is universal. The forbidden ritual regarding this gate to hell that takes place here is something no one is allowed to see or speak of. This strict taboo is probably the result of a ceremony concerning the border with hell coming closer to the living world. Villagers lead a simple life. Deep in the mountains, they struggle to forage food for their daily meals. The village has little contact with the outside world. They continue to practice the ways of old, frozen in time. Do they now? Well, Mayu is missing. What are we doing? Uh, what are we doing now? What did they say the ch name of Chapter Two was again? Did they say it was the Twin Shrine Maidens. Oh crap. Okay, so I guess we gotta remember where these butterflies are going. I can remember this angle here. That's where we turn right. Okay. Should I go around here looking for... Acquired the slow power-up lens. Okay. Slows down the movement of a spirit. Spirit power required one upgrade extends duration. Temporarily slows down the movement of the spirit being photographed. To use, press triangle button when you've charged one or more spirit power points. While this effect is active, the spirit will make slower and move slower, and shutter chances will be longer, making the spirit easier to capture. This is especially effective against quick spirits, or spirits that are difficult to time. Raising the level of this effect extends its duration. Okay. Measure. Equipped function. Shows spirit HP. When this function is equipped, it shows the remaining HP of the closest spirit in the capture circle in the viewfinder's upper left corner. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I can remember <coughs> where, uh, pretty sure I can remember where she goes. All right. Herbal medicine. Oh. Uh oh. This is a Ringu free zone. No Ringus allowed, all right? Get back. Does this one only take damage from zero shots? Shit. Uh. 
Okay. Got a moonstone and a spirit orb. Well, the game definitely rewards you for backtracking through the same environment a million times in order to be able to pass through the game. Which I guess isn't totally a bad thing. Fuck off. Damn it! Why did my camera just jerk out of the way? This is not good. That got him. Wait, that got him? Holy shit. I thought I missed. Let's see. Exorcismal power and shot range. Okay. I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to do this first. <laughs> Have a nice weekend, Ella Sandy Mac. Hi, Z29. Wow, you really don't want anyone to pronounce your username, do you? I had changed my name with slamming my keyboard, not really realizing it has a two month limit. <laughs> That's actually pretty fucking funny. <laughs>
<laughs> That's really unfortunate. <laughs> I'm about three days in. It kind of sucks. Wow, your poor keyboard. Maybe they belong to missing surveyors. For some reason, one of the statues is in the form of twins. I have also found a description of a twin deity statue. Deities? Deities? Deities. In the writings laying around the house. I looked down into the old well, but it was pitch black and I couldn't see a thing. If you listen closely, you can only hear wind blowing and it seems that the water has all dried up. I can't tell. I found a small shrine at the top of a long set of stairs, shrouded in mist. It seems very old, but it is well made. It has not fallen into disrepair. The entrance has a large butterfly. I came to this hill to take a look at the gate I passed through when I entered the village. But when I tried to find it, they seem to survey details of various locations, but the entries are cut off. There must be something about these places he's wrote about. Well, we started, we started this chapter in, uh, the upstairs area, so I can just like walk around. Did I did I check the uh, the bedroom in the front? Hey, cheese radar, you made it in time, man. Did I already check this room? I don't know that I did. I was just in here, wasn't I? Did I just miss something? The filament flickered for a moment. I don't think that there's anything else. What do I think so far? Well, uh, the apparent adjustments to the combat compared to Fatal Frame 1 are significantly better. It looks like Mayu's charm. Use radio on the menu screen to... Oh, you know, we haven't even been doing that yet. There is something upstairs. I guess I could check. Um, yeah, I'll go ahead and check that first, and then I'll, like, listen to Spirit Stones... I mean, we already we already started in this room, and I'm pretty sure I explored everything in here, like in this whole area, because this is where we started the chapter, and then we turned, and then I'm pretty sure this is this is it. 
I didn't see nothing else. Well, okay, there's some there's some herbal medicine. Huh. All right, well, time to go follow Mayu. We went all the way down here and turned to the right. This is my first horror game. I stopped playing the first time and took out the disc and hid in a corner because it spooked me. That bad, huh? Are we supposed to go down here? Crimson butterflies, huh? Here they are. Oh my god. Are we getting chased by villagers? Is this Resident Evil 4? I guess the twins tried to get away, but the villagers gave chase. That's what this is. I'm just taking a wild guess.
Oh, is this dude still alive? Dude, I just got hit upside the head with a... With a ghost... Ghost pipe. That ghost just laid down the pipe. Shit. Um, how much e EXP do I have right now? Enough? I guess I could do slow. Wait, no I can't. <laughs> Apparently I can't count. Well, so now what the fuck do we do? Do we look for crimson butterflies, or what? Can I try opening the door again, maybe? I'm gonna check it again, just to make sure that I'm not... Before I, like, start going somewhere looking for crimson butterflies that aren't there. I just need to check this one more time. Okay, the gate's stuck fast. There are ornaments on the left and right doors depicting two people. There is a slot in each of the ornaments for a... Inserting a flat square key. Okay. Let's go looking for butterflies. Yeah, this is my first time playing uh, Fatal Frame 2. This is all set up so I can just fucking start playing. And take my time, so. Let's, uh... Give it a go. I guess we can start going inside houses, huh? Ojamashimas! Shitsureshimas! that but uh, that's a fly Was that of any particular significance? I suppose that wasn't apparent. Heavy cloth sways in the wind. You reckon we're gonna get a peep behind it? Probably not. Did I see another door here, or was I... No. Okay. Alright, so that door is locked. We can go upstairs here. I'm going to leave that item there for now, just to make it clear that I didn't go across the bridge. Actually, you know what? That's a dumb idea. I can just look at the map. Chrysoberol. Chrysoberol?
large gate over a bridge inside a big house. There are many, many beds. Upstairs, there are dolls, buffets. I see. So there's a bridge. I'm just going to double check over here. Oh, there's another set of stairs, right? Yeah, okay. The stun power-up lens intermittently stops the movement of a spirit. Spirit power required to upgrade extends duration. Makes it easier to grab a shutter chance. Okay. Folklorist 2. The guardian deity statues in this area are different in that they are engraved with shrine maidens. The village children say that the statues honor the gods of the village. Also, a book in the house links the statues to something called the Crimson Sacrifice. Maybe the forbidden ritual is related to this Crimson Sacrifice. And I guess this is another uh, story Gotta seal the Hellgate, prevent another calamity, or something like that. Happy Friday, Papa Rain. How you doing? Who in the fuck? All right, well, let's cross this bridge. Let's see what's going on, huh? Shit. Damn it, why does the camera do that? Fatal frame.
we're following those. Because that seems like a good idea. The door is broken and you can see into the dim house. There are other rooms further in, but you can't see them from here. How did I like the first game? It wasn't it wasn't bad. It wasn't bad. Aside from aside from uh certain enemy mechanics. And like a lot of backtracking. It was like bad backtracking. door seems to be locked. Oh. But we can get in this way. Yai! What are you still doing here? Who are you? The ritual will begin soon. That happens. She's at the ceremony master's house. She's going to do it. Go get her. There's still time to catch up with her. The keys to the gate are enshrined in twin, de twin deity statues. Look for statues like that somewhere in the village. Yai, the ritual is about to start. Hurry! Two he keyholes, the gate to Whisper Bridge. When the confinement starts, the gate gets locked. The twin statue keys are hidden in the twin deity statue somewhere. Look for statues like that somewhere Yai. in the village. If we escape, I'm sure we can avoid the fate of the twin shrine maidens. Don't give up. Crimson butterflies? Maybe the butterflies will take us to... Wherever we need to go next, huh? If you cannot find a way to leave the village, come and find me. I may be able to help. Okay. I'll go ahead and save the game here. Hey, Tiger Actual. So that was the Osaka house that we were in. In the first part of the game. 
Is that right? Yeah, that's right. I didn't look in... I didn't look in the Tachibana house yet. Is there another save point over there? Oh man, this game's throwing save points at you right now. There's a statue of guardian deities here with a carving of twins on its face. You look all around it, but it doesn't look like there's a key hidden here. Really? I guess I gotta look for crimson butterflies then? Type 14 film. Oh, consolation prize. Okay, here we are. Here's something. A guardian deity statue depicting twins stands here. Examination of the lower portion of the statue uncovers a small wooden block. Twin statue key R. It's shaped like one of the stone statues, but it's only the right half. Oh, hey. more behind me. Sick just kill. Is there any more? I guess not. Maybe there's another with crimson butterflies around? Should I check out the Tachibana house first, or should I go up here? I kind of want to take a look at the Tachibana house first.
Alright, so we can't open the Tachibana house that way. What about if we go down this way and then up the stairs? What'll happen? Hmm. Give it a try. It's all locked. All right. Oh, hey, there was another item there that I missed. It's a bit far, but I was able to see it. It's right about there, right? Yep, there we go. I'm just going where I want for now. I pit my chance. But thank you. I haven't reached any dead ends yet. That's when I prefer to ask chat for help is when I've reached a dead end and I have no idea where I'm fucking going. Hey, thanks for watching Yeah, Boy, yeah Games. And I ain't streaming for much longer, a little of slapping. Just until, like, the end of this chapter. Shrine Shadow. On the door of what appears to be a shrine, a large butterfly mark is displayed. The surveyor must have been here. On the stairs in front of the entrance, a piece of a note lies. Village Report 3. It seems to be a continuation of the surveyor's notes that you found earlier. I found a small shrine at the top of a long set of stairs shrouded in mist. It seems very old, but it's well made and has not fallen into disrepair. The entrance has a large butterfly, butterfly crest painted on it. It's the same as the one on the building beyond the large bridge. Butterflies seem to have a special meaning, just like twins. They are frequently mentioned in the ritual literature. Butterfly means something else to the villagers, too. I notice that the word always appears in writings about the ritual. I may not know its exact meaning, but the fact that the butterfly crest is on a shrine indicates that it is very special indeed. I should investigate further. Well, now that I can enter that but. missed it, didn't I? How am I doing today? Eh, not doing bad. Not doing bad at all.
Um, I've been keeping face cam off because these are meant to be like, like it's just for the purpose of like immersing in the game. And I feel like having my face on the camera kind of detracts from that a little bit. Hey Trap, how's it going? Oh no, absolutely. I mean, there's going to be there's going to be times where I'm going to want to be on camera, but for the most part for the most part, I just like want to try to experiment with like keeping my camera off in places. Shit. Now these fucking douchebags. Let's go inside. Countless talismans with eerie writing on them are stuck onto the lattice. Beyond the lattice, you can see a straw doll lying down. It's about the size of a person. Spirit Orb. Perfect. An old mirror has been enshrined in front of the altar with the crimson butterfly picture. Dude, I'm just gonna rain. I'm just gonna get more range, cause I want to keep these bastards in my crosshairs as much as possible. Like you can bet your ass, that's what I'm starting with. It worked for me in Fatal Frame One, kinda. At least I hope I was on the right track. Am I missing something here? Oh, there's a there's a door in here. Okay, we can't open that because of all these talismans. Did we check the uh, the altar here yet? An old mirror has been enshrined in front of the altar with a crimson butterfly picture. 
Okay, well, I guess we've done about all we can do. Uh, maybe it's time to go. I'm probably missing something huge in there. Because I can't fucking examine literally everything. I suppose I got plenty of things to discover around these parts. Yeah, this is my first time playing Fatal Frame 2. This is the farthest I've ever gotten in the video game. Hey, there's a fire. There's fires. Were these lit before? Hey, check it. There's more crimson butterflies. A guardian deity statue depicting twin stands here. Examination of the lower portion of the statue uncovers a small wooden block. There we are. I guess... What now? What?
Well, you gotta be really quick on that one, don't you? Yeah, the guy with the pole is a fucking D-bag. Fuck that guy. The window for being able to hit him with a zero shot is so fucking tiny. Did I go the right way? Oh, what the hell? I think I'm somewhere I'm not really supposed to be yet. What time am I planning to go to bed? Uh, after this chapter's over. Is what I was planning is when I was planning to go to bed. How much longer do I have on this chapter? Can anyone tell me? I'm just trying to look for a good like stopping point. Still pretty early in the chapter. Fuck. Okay. Then I guess I'm uh, gonna have to call it a little early. Door to the shrine is shut. Is there a save point like right after we put the the keys in the in the gate? Oh, okay. All right, that's cool. Then I guess I'll just do that. Appears to lead into some sort of cave. Do we come out of there later, perhaps? There's always Kohi. Well, I I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to drink coffee. I really don't want to drink coffee. Because I've been burning the candle at both ends for the last like week or so. By the way, uh, just so you guys know, I won't be streaming the next couple of days. I'm trying to make the uh, trying to make the schedule a thing on my stream, but I will be back Monday, and I'm going to be taking like two days off in a row, spending it all with my girlfriend. And cleaning up my apartment. Yeah, I think I worked really hard this week. Hey, Fat Louie, how you doing? I mean, yeah, listen to your body, little slapping. If you're feeling, if you're feeling tired, you know. Don't just, like, keep watching my stream because of, like, fear of missing out or some shit like that. Because, I'll tell you what, fucking FOMO has been the number one driving force behind all of my streaming for the past five years, and it's led to nothing but burnout. And being able to recognize FOMO is very, very difficult.
FOMO is an acronym for fear of missing out. Oh, this is the bridge that uh, Miyu was talking about. So we're still pretty early in the chapter, huh? I don't have FOMO, but I do suffer from BOFA. What's BOFA? Did I just miss a, a shot opportunity? Both of these nuts. Oh! Why would you do this to me, Zap Six Twenty Nine? Where's this bitch? Well, here's our save point. All right. Well, when I come back here on uh, Monday, we're going to continue with this. Did pretty good so far. So thank you all for watching. And see everyone in part two.